If you are an electronics enthusiast, love playing with Arduino, Raspberry Pi and making DIY robots and circuits, this free feature of Altium PCB Designer will be a life changer for you. In this video, I will be explaining how DIY electronics enthusiasts like us can make use of this awesome feature in our projects. If you don't know what Altium is, Altium is a PCB designer that can be used to create simple PCBs for a hobby projects or complex and multi-layer PCBs for industrial use. It's easy to create our own PCBs using Altium. If you are a DIY electronics enthusiast, you're gonna love it. You can download and install the free trial version from the description down below. And if you're a student, you get a 6 month full license absolutely free. Don't miss out. Altium subscription includes something called Altium 365 which lets you design, share and manufacture your projects everything in one place. Secure centralized cloud storage lets you share, design ideas with teammates or clients easily. Let's see how we can do that using Altium 365. Now we are an Altium designer. Now if you take a look at the top right corner, you should be able to see this button not connected right? Simply click on that. And there you will see another button activate workspace. Simply click on that and that will open up a browser. And here we will have the option to create our workspace. Okay, now first let's give it a name. Let's name it root Z. And the closest location, Europe looks fine. And give it a description. Let's give it root Z workspace. And simply click on this activate button. Now it will create a workspace for us. It could take a while, so I'll be fast forwarding this video. Okay guys, looks like it's done. Alright, this is our workspace, it's now up and running. Now let's minimize this window and go back to Altium. And now on the right side, we can see a message, right? You have a new workspace. Now simply click on that node connected button again and there you will have our workspace. Simply click on that. Okay, it's now connecting. Okay, it's now connecting to our workspace. Let's wait a moment. Alright, now it's done. Now, let's go back to our browser. Okay, this is the get started page. Click on the projects link. Alright, there you should be able to see some projects, right? These are actually some of the sample projects that are populated by Altium itself. So if you want to delete this, simply click on these three dots. Alright, now at the bottom you should be able to see this delete option and confirm the delete. Alright, that project is now being deleted from our workspace. If you want, you can delete all these projects like this. I won't be using this project, so I'll be deleting all of them. Okay, now it's done. Okay. At the moment, we don't have any projects in our workspace, right? Now, let's minimize this and go back to Altium PCB Designer. Now, on the left side, you should be able to see all the projects that you have worked on, right? Let's say we want to upload one project to our workspace. Say, we need to upload this one. First, make sure you are connected to the workspace. For that, simply click here. Yep, it's connected. And now, right click on the project and click on Make Project Available Online. Now, give this project a name and a description. Let's say Arduino HID functionality. And click on OK button. Alright, this project is now being uploaded to our workspace and that should be available in our workspace from our browser. So let's wait, it could take some time. Alright, it's finished. Now we should be able to see this message. Our project is now currently registered to our workspace. This is just a message window so you can close it and go back to our browser. We are now in the projects page. Now let's refresh this page. It could take a while and here we are. We have the project that was uploaded from our ILTM designer. Simply click on that. Open it. And here we have it. Here is the schematics file. Now let's try to open the PCB file. Alright, here we go. And now let's take a look at the 3D view. Perfect. And we also have the bill of material file. From now on, you should be able to easily access all these files from a browser from anywhere around the world. That's the best thing about Altium 365. Well, not just you. 
If you have friend working on the same project, both of you should be able to work on this together in real time using Altium 365. Now, I will give you a small tip that might save a lot of your money. Before adding components to your circuit, it's always a good idea to understand everything about the components such as the availability, specification, the price, etc. And for this, I will recommend a free site called Octopart, which is an electronic component search engine from where you will get complete information about all the components that you will need for your project. You can also use Octopart to find the components that meets your requirement. You can even purchase the component by clicking the link there itself. It's a free solution for almost all of your programs regarding components and you will get everything in one place. This is also going to be really useful for you guys. So make sure you check it out. Now, let's see how we can share this project with your teammate or your friend in real time using Altium 365. In order to share, first open the project you want to share and on the top right, you should be able to see this share button. And in this box, simply enter the email IDs of all the person you want to share this project with and from here, provide which permission you want to give that person. Let's give him edit permission and click on this share button. From now on, this project will be accessible to all those users and since you provided edit permission, they'll be able to edit this project as well. You can make changes to the circuit diagram, the PCB file or add comments to this project and work together easily in real time. This is just a glimpse of what you can do with Altium 365. Stay tuned for more. And the best part is Altium 365 requests no additional licenses and comes included with your subscription plan. Like I told you, this is going to be a life changer for you guys. Once you start using it, you will understand the full benefits. If you have any doubts regarding Altium or Altium 365, do let me know in the comments. See you in the next video.